Ladies and gentlemen, the Double RT Boxing Show with Mr. A post fight recap number 37 will begin shortly in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Thank you, thank you, thank you for tuning in, folks. This is Ready Ready Talk Boxing. I'm your host, Mr. A. You know, David Benavides does it again. He wins another uh, 12-round decision over uh, Ronald Gorel, but this time in a unanimous decision, and definitely a well-deserving unanimous decision. This was a clean sweep, maybe one round for Ronald, but a clean sweep for David. He put uh, power punches together with combination power punches. He's, he was able to change up set up set up punches and hit him with hooks you know he at the end he showed his hands both hands were jacked up but give it up for Garrell man that dude could take some punches he took a mean uppercut left hook combination that sent him stumbling to the ropes questionably could have been called a knockdown because the ropes held him up but you know I'm okay with it not being called a knockdown it was just an easy decision to make. Now, what you can say is, uh, will what can David go from here? Because you can see he does get caught a little bit to the body, a little too easy. Now, is it that he just takes it? And because he didn't feel Gravel could hurt him, or is that his one opening? Because he is a tall guy and he fights like that. And so his, his midsection, like I said, he looks soft because, you know, he came from such like 200 pounds down to 168. To me, that's one of the only flaws I really see in David's game right now because he's pretty good at catching defensively. You know, Ronald Gravel probably caught him one good shot, I think, like in the eighth round backing up, caught him one good one. But for the most part, David's big flaw, or I shouldn't say flaw, his opening defensively is uh, you can could, you could, you could stab jab him to the, to the stomach. And that being said, he, it was just a, a round after round softball setup, hit, hit him hard combination. Like I said, at one point, the you know, the fans going, Mexico, Mexico, and he stops the fight, you know, like, waves his hand, like, yeah, yeah, let's go, let's go. It, it, he, it was a easy, easy victory. Gravel, at one point in the, um, I think it was like the eighth round, he he was getting hit hard with some shots, and he hit again, he got hit with a hard body shot, and Gravel, like, it literally spit out his mouth, he's like, I guess he just could not breathe, he... It was a hard hit. Like I said, this 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 rematch, even though it wasn't a knockout like any of them predicted, it was a very easy fight to call. A well-deserved unanimous decision for David Benavides. He retains his WBC super middleweight title, no problem. Uh, round after round, he landed almost any punch he wanted on him. Clean, like I said, poise, patience. Uh, the punch variation, Ronald could not counter because he didn't know what was coming, couldn't predict it. Now, I would like to see since the the WBC is almost over between Groves and the winner of Kellum Smith and um, Jurgen. Now, I always I'm going with the WBC set because remember they the winner gets that WBC diamond belt in that tournament. So I think the winner. Fights David Benavides because he's WBC related. You know they got the WBC belt in the tournament, the Muhammad Ali belt. Now, until that moment, I would like to see Benavides and Ramirez. That'd be a hell of a fight. Put that fight in either in Texas or bring it out to here to the forum. You know, some heavy uh, Mexican fan base, and that fight would do tremendously good. But David Benavides easily, easily just uh, just out 
just outworks, outpunch, outlands uh, Ronald Gravel in this rematch. Well deserved United Decision victory. Mr. A says, thank you for your support. If you are a new viewer, please become a new subscriber. Help the show grow. I'm giving you a thumbs up for my for your support of the show. Please give this episode, this segment of Post Fight Recaps of the Double RT Boxing Show. Give this segment a thumbs up, and I will see you on the next one. We got fights to come still on the breakdown. We got a uh, Minson Figgin Bunts with his TKO. We got uh, Groves and Eubanks coming. We got a uh, Victor Ortiz and Alexander coming. We got fights to come, folks. We got fights to come. So I'll see you on the next one.